I am running to represent the people of Nevada's first district. I'm running because we deserve more. And fortunately, in 2015, I experienced the loss of my daughter due to our for profit health care system. And it was at that time that I knew we needed someone like me in Congress. We needed to have people who understood the struggle. In 2015, my daughter, Shalyn, decided to move back home to complete her schooling. She was going to school to become a nurse. When she arrived, she said that she had a red and swollen leg. As the pain increased, she decided that she was gonna to go to a local emergency room to get it checked out. Upon arriving at the hospital, they immediately asked her, do you have insurance? And Shalyn replied, no and her fate was sealed at that moment. I received a call from Shalyn saying that, you know, mommy, I'm begging for something for the pain and I am asking them to do further testing and they've told me that I need to go get insurance and see a specialist. A bedside ultrasound and a prescription of medication could have saved her life. I knew at that moment I could not close my eyes once they had been opened. I had to stand up and fight back. And that is essentially what I promised Shalyn on her deathbed, that she would not have died in vain. And I happened to run across a video of Senator Sanders back in 1993, talking about the need for universal health care and how people were dying and suffering without it. We are the only major industrialized country on earth without universal comprehensive health care. And I knew that this would be my life's mission to ensure that no one else suffered the same undescribable pain and agony that me and my family went through for an unnecessary death. I threw the first healthcare rally here in Las Vegas for Medicare for All, and I have been in this fight since then. In Congress, I plan to be one of the leading voices for Medicare for All.